everyone, it's Jennifer with DP Addiction Adventures and welcome to part two of my finished stash from the last couple years. In part one, I talked about Craftably's Artist Tube. Um, I just wanted to show you. So I put a couple of my large diamond paintings in here. It fits three large ones very comfortably, keeps them nice and tight in there. You wanna roll it with your drills out. Otherwise, you will get distorted drills when you open it up. They'll be all moved around. So I wanted to show you that. And we're going to dive into some more. Okay, so first, here's Crafties. Crafties has bite-sized pieces, glow-in-the-dark drills, everything like that. Go check them out. So much fun. This happens to be one of my favorites. This is a... Um, is it a Jasmine Beckett Griffith? And this is the one when it was, let's see, round, I believe. They now have a square one that's a little bit bigger, but I really love doing this. I put glow in the dark drills in the moon. I put some diamond painting drills Raven in her hair. I just had a lot of fun using the 310 ABs to add some more depth to her wings had a lot of fun with this one all right here's another treasure studios had so much fun doing this with Rebecca there was our monster mash just cute and light and a lot of fun all right here's another whip I have I need to finish her so I'm going to keep her out this is a Maleficent from um, Treasure Studios, and this is also another um, Lizzie Falcon. Having a lot of fun. I just have that upper right corner left to do. So I'm gonna put that in my whip pile. Whip stands for work in progress. All right, here's another crystal canvas art design. They have so many cute animals. I have a bunch of animals in my stash. I need to just go through and do a whole bunch and have some fun. All right, did you realize that DP with Sparklers had several of their own diamond paintings done? So I did this one, absolutely loved it. I switched out some of the crystals for ABs. I did some metallics, really tried to help those flowers pop. Okay, so then we have Diamond Painting Factory. They actually have changed hands multiple times. Um, this was uh, um, from Willowing, and we did a, we met the artist, and at Crash, Crashly and I did this as a collab together. Here's another Craftably. I don't think they sell this anymore. I absolutely loved doing this one. All the colors, all the bling. They gave you three ABs in this one, and I added some of my own as well. Okay, this is what inspired me to do the Get Your Weird On. This was my pig <laughs> mermaid, if you guys remembered. It wasn't really an event, but I had a lot of fun blinging out these pigs. We now do a March Get Your Weird On. So if you have any paintings that are a little off kilter or even out of the ordinary for you, Let's say you normally do a Hannah Lynn and you want to do a landscape instead. You know, put that aside. In March, we're going to have a get your weird on. All right. This is a huge painting I started. And I didn't finish it. This goes in my whips. I need to work on it a little bit. Um, I think this was a time in my life where there was just too much life going on, so I've connected it with some of that, and so I haven't picked it back up. But it is a beautiful canvas. It was for an event. It's uh, Notre Dame by David um, McLean, and it's absolutely gorgeous. It just goes in my work in progress. Let's put it over there. Okay, so this is another Treasure Studios. I really like Doctor Who, so I had to do a police box. Had so much fun with this one, blinging this out. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, here's another work in progress. I was doing this one around the same time as the Notre Dame one. It's 
So this is gonna go in my work in progress. I was doing this class with Crashly. Need to finish up my Harley Quinn. And this was from um, Dreamer Design. Okay, we're getting down to the bottom. All right, I did this little snack piece. This is from Leisure Arts. He's just so cute and fun. He was on sale for, at Hobby Lobby. They're a diamond um, dots company. He was a lot of fun. Okay, this is from Treasure Studios. They still have this one. If you recognize this, this is my DP Addiction Adventures logo with just a little pizzazz to it. You can get it in crystal, square, or round. I just think it's a lot of fun. I hope to frame it. See, this is why it fell off the easel, and so I have to put those back. But I did get a frame from the framing company I will be talking about with you, and I hope to frame it and put it up on my wall. Okay, we have a Hannah Lynn. I love sunflowers. One of my favorite flowers. I like daisies as well. So this was a lot of fun to work on. I did that for a Hannah lynn -a -thon. All right, this is a work in progress, but then snow left. And in Michigan, when snow leaves, you don't want to think about it for a while. So I will be pulling this back out this winter. This is from Dreamer Designs. So this is also gonna go in my work in progress. I've been having a lot of fun using um, some icicles from paint, uh, diamond painting drills, using some half pearls. I'm just having a lot of fun bleeding this out and didn't wanna rush it. And then I'm working on this from Treasure Studios. It's one of my work in progress as well having a lot of fun working on adding extra crystals and glow in the dark. And then this, I'm having fun with Enablers Outpost. If this artist gets more through Enablers Outpost, I'm definitely ordering it. This is my cute little elephant. So yeah, I know there's at least 50 more paintings that I've done that you haven't seen. But this is what was on my easel, and I thought you would enjoy looking through my completed stash for the past couple years. So thank you for sticking around. Uh, let me know what painting you're working on. What was your favorite in this video? What company do you want to check out? I have several that are in work in progress as well from different companies and small businesses, and I can't wait to show you. So until next time, be blessed. Take care. I'm gonna go store all of these so we can get them out of the way of my one-year-old. Um, so love you all, see you next time, bye-bye.